advantage of the heat of the day and do some pond maintenance. Any successful permaculture garden includes some aquaculture. I have around a 7,000 gallon pond here, which I've stocked with some native sunfish, and that'll give me about 300 pounds of fish a year. For my pond maintenance, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put some BT. This is gonna kill the mosquito larvae and the Chinese moth larvae. Now I'm gonna use some barley straw pellets. And what this is gonna do, it's gonna raise the pH level of our water, making it really a good environment for our fish. Next, I'm gonna use some beneficial bacteria. These last two products are both from the Microlift Corporation, and they're amazing to get just crystal clear water in your pond. The beneficial bacteria is gonna seed my filters and get rid of all of those harmful nitrates and ammonias. Mm. Smells like rotten eggs, but that actually means it's good. We've got some beneficial bacteria in here. So now I have to clean my filtering fountain system. Just gonna jump right in. fountain I have has a filter attached that houses the pump. I also have a biodynamic filter. The water is pumped over the lava rocks. Lava rocks clean the water by neutralizing it. I hose down my filters on my lawn, which helps fertilize it. My pond filters need to be cleaned out regularly when they're in use. I'm done here for today, just in time before the rain starts. So thanks for watching. I'm Patty the Garden Girl for FarmersAlmanac.com.